I'm gonna make it look like you. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make it look like you. You left a casserole in the oven, but the stove is gonna be not on fire or nothing. There's just gonna be a cold casserole sitting in there. And with that being said, welcome back to the newest episode of IDGAF, <laughs> where we simply, as you can hear, don't give a fuck. Today we have my boy Mossy Moss. So, my boy Mossy Moss. Pharaoh's here today too. Uh, the same cold savant is then. not. I don't know if another person in this party is going to talk. Yeah, see. So unless I'm they do, I'm not going to introduce them. What? See, I'm his okay, replacement. Okay, and I. There she is. <laughs> How everybody doing today? Beautiful day. Smoking that took... sable pack. Shut up. We just took we just oh took two God. doves on Fortnite. We we hit we them. Savon, you trash. No, you know who's <laughs> them. Shout out, shout out, UT. Hashtag go Vols. Hashtag smoking that Bama pack. He's still with the same city. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> been, <laughs> been 16 <laughs> years. Been 16 years. Finally won one. And we're going to we're going to the national championship. We're gonna win that. Uh, that's all I gotta say about pack. that. <laughs> smoke that Bama oh, pack. <laughs> Yo, I love oh, that. Listen, uh, <laughs> he, he's a guest. The whole, they had the whole speed. Bro, they had the whole stadium lighting up cigars, son. They was smoking that cigars? Bama. Hey, yo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Well, now they had uh, Peyton Manning uh, in the oh, building. Now, for those who don't know, he also played for UT. So even Peyton Manning was smoking on that Bama pack. <laughs> we turned into ESPN real quick. Yeah. We Facts. <laughs> I don't know anything about that, so I wouldn't be able to be on the podcast. I don't know nothing about sports. Whatsoever. But guess I'm gonna tell you what I do know about. Did y'all hear about the recent activities at Twitch at TwitchCon? Everybody get in touch. No. All right. So we are on the last podcast. I mean that too. We most kind of summed it up. But anyway, so the last podcast talked about how the uh the ex porn star broke two places in her back jumping into a foam pit, which is ironic. Yeah. Huh? Let me oh, find oh, out. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We talked about that last podcast. Let me find you out. Work, Pharaoh. You were at work, I ain't gonna lie. Oh, bro. so y'all did the podcast without me. Y'all ain't shit. You know Thank that? You. Thank you. Yeah, we well, don't listen, love you. Well, now Savon not here for it. But then again, let's be real. Let's say we did start it when Savon was here. He probably would have left it in the middle of the podcast anyway, like he did before. Because he ain't shit. Damn. He, he would be like, put, put some respect on my name and then just left. Just walked no, out. No, he know why he left. But anyway, same, why he, same reason why he not here now, but we ain't gonna talk about it. But um, Is that why know, he... I want to take a minute and talk about that for a second. Is it because I'm not really talking about it, but say something, Savon? You a bitch, bro, for choosing this bitch over the homies. <laughs> homies <laughs> over hoes, bro. Homies over hoes. Huh? What about Moss? I thought the Moss was gonna be the one to say it. I ain't gonna lie to you at all. I thought Moss was gonna say it. Listen, dog. Listen, dog. We can't turn no hoe into a housewife. So anybody there trying to claim Savon, it's too late. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't ready for that. That was disrespectful. <laughs> Back on the, the topic of TwitchCon. Um, You're parody. smoking that Vaughn pack tonight. Oh my god, Moss. God damn it. <laughs> so anyway, I was talking about well, how... Hey, why this... are you getting mad at me? Let me finish what talking. I do? You're not No, no, this is my podcast. No, it's this not. Shut podcast. up. Shut up. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> like I was saying. Really? <laughs> yes. Because it kind of sounds like you ain't in control right now. Because you listen to this me. This is Moss's special episode. <laughs> Moss yeah, my special episode once a year. <laughs> hey. You want to try it? You want to get, get your pack smoked? Let me know. <laughs> let me find out. So back yeah. to what Twitch So apparently yeah. there's a bunch of sexual assault allegations coming out at all at one time like apparently the female streamers getting groped by the fans and sexually harassed and even a rape allegation wait i can't say that on oh YouTube. Well, it's, it's too late i already said it or allegation on um on even their fellow twitch streamers it also has been happening Bro, uh let me say something a lot let me say something what? let me say something what? All I'm saying is, is they did a good job of hiding the cupcakes because I didn't hear nobody talk about EDP coming up and taking them cupcakes, all right? So like I was saying, <laughs> uh, <laughs> they were not, 
They were not underage, but EDP. it was still... <laughs> EDP oh smoking that cupcake pack. <laughs> oh, sure they weren't underage, but it still happened. Me. So yeah, it huh? wasn't. They were not underage, but it still happened. Like, like talking about they got sexual assaulted the whole day there. Um, how did you get sexual how? assaulted? How? Yeah, the yeah, whole and like day. That's like that one dude said he got he got molested for a whole summer. Like, how do you get molested for a whole summer? Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I hate you. Like, like me too, moment doll. Like, get off me. What? Uh huh. But no, like, like, like the whole day, like they take pictures of fans, fans grabbing their breasts, etc. Whole lot of other stuff. I'm sorry. What? So it's like. My thing is that's they need some better shit going on with that, and also they need to speak up because the fact that it took one person to come out for everybody else to come out too, some should have been said. Yeah, some should have been said. It's it's not. The it's play. the domino effect, and they don't want to be the one that that cried wolf, and then everybody look mm-hmm. at and laugh. You know what I mean? Like there has to be support behind the movement. I don't think yeah. so. I feel like they wait too long. It's like, like it's like somebody waiting twelve <clears throat> years to come out with something <clears throat> crucial. Bro, that was twelve yo, could, years ago. I I don't understand that. Yo, can we talk about something else real quick? Hold on, let's finish. Let's finish, let's finish up on this first. My bad, my bad, my bad. No, 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 you're first good, time you're being good. here. Sorry, guys. It's Sorry, guys. Time. First time <laughs> being here. <laughs> yeah, no. Nah, after this, we're going right back to Fortnite. Anyway, so uh, yes, yeah. It was just like it was not even just one or two. It was several, several Twitch streamers talking about it, talking about how uh, they uh. They were also putting stuff in their drink to make them drowsy. Now, I don't, I don't know if I believe this next story, but it's, first off, it, no, hold on, let me first this, off, because I don't want, I'm not trying to laugh when I say it. So that's horrible. One dude, one dude has said that it was 2012 at TwitchCon, right? He said his friend went there. He was he was drunk the whole day. He would go up and take the ladies' drinks. And then like drink it like like different women's drinks, and he had to go to the what hospital. About it? He had he had to go to the hospital because they were all the drinks were drugged. Oh wow! Wow, like all of them. Like I'm like, bro, that's fucking I'm, sick. That's hilarious. If you ask that's, me, no that's cap. scary. Yeah, yeah, you can't even. He kind of got what he deserved. <laughs> he did, but damn, that's that's just bad management right there. Like mm-hmm. it, you, the the moment somebody gets hurt in a phone pit is when is when you know you you doing something completely wrong. Like that phone not even not even foaming right. So what else are you doing? First of all, let, <laughs> let, let's talk about that phone pit for a second. Who thought it was a good idea to put a put a a let, let's call it a pillar in the middle of a phone pit and put foam things on top of it? Like like they was just asking to get somebody hurt. Like. <laughs> now the the pillar to knock people off, but it's the fact that that foam did not look comfortable when she landed. Like she was still on top. No, of she the didn't foam. hit no foam, dog. She hit a platform. Bro, I, did you I, see I, the video? She, bro. she hit all floor. <laughs> she, she, I'm telling you, bro. I don't know what's going that on. One, that was that was that, bad. That one square hmm. broke her fall, and I wish that square was me, but that's a story for Shut another up, day. Shut up, you stupid. Shut up, Jesus. He said, I wish that square was me. <laughs> it should have been me. I mean. <laughs> it's not hey, fair. Yo. I, I sound like someone. Hey, yo, I hate to bring this up. I hate to bring this up at, like, a, such a bad time, but, like, did y'all hear about the uh, the tax the tax forms that got released by the organization known as BLM? No. Did y'all hear about that? I haven't heard about it. Oh, somebody's going to federal prison. That's all I know. I saw an ad on taxes? Uh, YouTube. No, no, they did not pay a single tax on all that money that they got. They're yeah, going to be put. They're going to be put under the jail, and I kind of feel bad for them because it's like they raised oh, no. all of that money to do stuff, but then they ended up spending it on like mansions and all this stuff. Yeah, I, I, don't, I, don't, I, mean, I don't know bro. because all that untaxed money is probably going to bail them out of jail. Yeah, but yeah. see, see, they gonna pull. They gonna pull one of them. Like they gonna pull one of them. Oh, we're rich, so we don't gotta do nothing. And then bro, that was foul. It, they, they they literally took they took advantage. Of- 
they took the people's took, money and did whatever they wanted. Uh, trust and money and all that. <clears throat> Me personally, absolutely. The, I was like, what in my head? I was like, what are these people donating to though? Like, understand yeah. they're donating to the organization BLM. But not knowing but exactly what, what they they're donating doing to. With, well, the moment they said they bought a mansion with that money, I'm like, I'm happy I didn't donate. God damn, that would have made me mad as hell. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You can't even trust where your money goes nowadays when they be like, you want to donate to a children's hospital? And there's just some person in the goddamn mansion going on their way to, to get on a goddamn super yacht. It's sick. <laughs> Donate to the children's hospital, and they ended up taking that money, and they in there, <laughs> they in there not helping the children. And they're like, he ain't going. Oh, that's horrible. Make it, he ain't gonna make it to 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 see a uh, uh fucking Rocky Mountain and goddamn Six Flags anyway, or some shit. I don't know. Yo, this is crazy, bro. Oh no. <sighs> yeah. Yo, can we also talk about something? Because like, um, like, can someone explain to me about how how certain people can get away with like the most like outrageous things? You know what I mean? Because like, I feel like people be getting away with everything nowadays. Like literal murder. Like people get away with murder in, in today's day and age. If you got enough money, you can get away with anything. See, that's the problem. <laughs> Like, I'm all for capitalism, but, like, when does it become too much? When they don't have enough money. <laughs> but the rich That's stay facts. rich. This, this, how, this is how it stays, bro. Money equals power. Lack of money equals lack of power, right? If you got enough <laughs> money to say fuck it, then that, that's really what it is. Fuck it. Um... You're not going to ever hear nobody like taking all of somebody's money because <clears> they <throat> did wrong with the money. I just, I just haven't heard of it. True. Unless they, they got it like illegally of somewhat like, but then again, there's people that stabbed us been selling drugs and still has that money because they just has, haven't got caught. So it's true. Though. It's yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's a different, it's a different way of, uh, living especially if they don't put that money in the bank account either yeah you ain't gonna find that that's an offshore one at that mm -hmm. well i mean you gotta also understand the way that they can allegedly track money nowadays i think that's the stupidest thing ever how are you gonna track a paper bill bro they gotta put mini trackers on the nanobots bro nanobots this man really just said nanobots bro, mm. yeah, you gotta put a nanobot per dollar bill bro so you know where each dollar bill goes bro until the until the government prints more because they need more money <laughs> you are up yes see, I wouldn't uh, you are, I would uh, admit, yeah see i wouldn't admit that to on live television like that sorry nah bro i'm a op bro don't trust me bro well Trust me, you're going to jail, bro. About to be <laughs> okay, snitch nine. <laughs> yep, you listen. I ha I have a hush. I have a hush fee. It's called a uh, five hundred dollars. See, it's not even that's it. crazy. Yep. In fact, say nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. That, that's got the same. Listen, listen. <laughs> if you broke, just say that. <laughs> nah, it's literally it's 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 less enough for them to just pay it off instead of me putting it too high to them just killing me. I prefer that one. <laughs> I prefer the less enough one. So, so, yeah. so, I mean, even if you're, even if you're stingy with it, you can still kill them. That's what I'm hearing. I mean, I, you, I prefer you not to. It's $500. If you are, if you over here, El Chapo win that shit, which you still might fucking just kill him anyway. It's a lot easier just give me the $500. That, that, that's really it. I mean, then again, it's, it's a lot easier just throw somebody in the lake. Is it the How the hell did we get here? Uh, you know that's how did we get though. here this is what we call a rabbit trail i am fantastic at these things you know oh, why I, I because noticed. it gets us I have noticed. it has only been 14 minutes i have noticed <laughs> oh oh so you want me to stop talking no i no i'm saying it's been yeah minutes. well guess what that ain't gonna happen i, I didn't say you <laughs> stop talking the same we've been to like 30 <laughs> ideas in 14 minutes i mean listen i'm entertaining i'm sorry you are all right I'm I okay. Yeah, you I listen, mm -hmm. listen. All you gotta do is stick to the Fortnite. That's all you need to do. 
stick to the Fortnite. I'm not even playing that right now. I know you're not. I'm just saying when we get back on it. Yeah. Oh, facts, facts, facts. Yeah. But yeah, it's just, uh, it's crazy. How do these people begin the stuff they have into these uh, community um, events? Like, Twitch is such uh I don't know I'm pretty sure it's a billion dollar company I can, I I don't remember it's million or billion it's it's, way, it's it's it Amazon. is most Which, definitely Twitch is billion. owned by Amazon it's a billion dollar company gotcha. that's a so, multi billion dollar company so for a multi billion dollar <laughs> company to maybe be making these crazy ass mistakes and honestly it's been so much going on with Twitch lately it's been crazy it's been crazy <laughs> they've been under fire for weeks. What I want to know is, <laughs> why hasn't a TwitchCon been shut Yeah, they got me yet? ready to switch platforms. Might have to. I stream on both. You said, why hasn't what, uh, Moss? Why hasn't a TwitchCon been shut up yet? Like, right, let's be honest. Huh? Don't bring uh, that up now. Jesus, there's certain things uh, you can't we do not, say. Uh, we do not, uh, yeah, we condone don't that. Agree. We don't condone shooting up of any events. Oh, I'm not we condoning don't. it. I'm just asking. <laughs> I'm just that uh, because, like, I mean, no ideas and no crazy person's goddamn head. I'm gonna be honest with you. Find that one person. I'm gonna be honest with you. Okay, here's the here's my opinion on it, right? So now, normally, from those situations, it's because the person's been wrong, right? And they want to get revenge on whatever it was that caused that problem. Now, based off of yeah. what you just told me here, a lot of what's happening is happening to women, and usually that's just not something women do. Ah, uh, that is true. That is true. I agree with that statement. <sighs> it's 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 something, man. Mm -hmm. Especially when um, yeah. I'm still sick because like I brought this up before. I'm gonna bring it up again. Jadion was permanently banned on Twitch for just raiding somebody's stream when some other person was straight out streaming streaming porn. It was her. She she was doing the porn. Got banned for seven days. <laughs> I'm sorry, yeah. what? So, yeah, We're going to have to rewind this. So, Run me through this so again. Gideon, he he is a Who's Twitch that? streamer, prankster. He's he's big on YouTube uh, and Twitch, but he got permanently banned on Twitch. So he's just now on YouTube. Oh. Yeah, he got he banned. Get? So he went, because there was one day he was he had more uh more viewers than Pokimane on his, uh, in his chat and, and on his stream. He said, oh, for his mm -hmm. joke, go to her stream and um, be like, L ratio, Gideon is better, just, just, just mess with her. He said a shirt like that. Like saying, G and they was like, like Gideon sent me here, Gideon sent me here. And like, apparently, and I, and I believe Twitch didn't like that. And uh, he got permanently banned. He also did make a remark saying, uh, telling his followers, she's not going to fuck you, bro. She's not going to fuck you. Stop snitching. Hey, yo. So. That was also that was done in bad taste, but but compared to that, to somebody uh having sex on goddamn stream is something different. I mean, yeah. but hold on, here's the thing. I right? mean, so now, there is a I platform do... for that, but that Twitch is not that platform. <laughs> yeah. So hold on, I do want to say something about that though, because apparently I I watch a YouTuber who covered that whole situation, mm -hmm. and now granted, I do think she should have been punished, but I don't think a perma ban would have been. In order because what happened was apparently she only streamed for 15 seconds and it was like an accidental thing like she left her stream on or whatever when she started uh -huh. so i don't think she should have been perma banned but i do think some kind of punishment should have been in order and i don't think he should have been perma banned for raiding another stream it's not like he sent them to say racial slurs or whatever like uh -huh. yeah that's where the line is should. crossed right there no, yeah i wasn't saying <laughs> she should be permanently banned i'm just saying the two damn events and the consequences to each event was drastically different, and situations were basically mm. drastically different as well. And one was worse than the other, so it's like, yes, that's, yeah. that's crazy. And then um, and apparently on Twitch, there's mm -hmm. there that's notoriously been a thing that happens. Like women get women get away with murder on Twitch, whereas if guys do something wrong, it's you no. Know, and especially uh, it's a problem. One, one Twitch streamer, she uh, threatened to shoot up the whole Twitch headquarters. Because they, uh, I'm sorry, what? Yeah, she, she, she went to Twitter, tagged Twitch, all that, said, I'm gonna, I want to shoot up the headquarter <laughs> of Twitch and, uh, for permanently banning her, right? Then they unbanned her for that. They took away the perma ban and just unbanned her completely. Uh, <laughs> I heard about oh. that shit, yeah. 
Yeah, and she, I think she Listen, listen, didn't you learn know. about that life, and then there's that shit and then being there, about that life, that. and then they get scared about that? How? Okay, listen, how are you going to reward that type of behavior when that's actually, like, a serious thing in the United States? Like, how yeah. are you actually going to, like, are you going to be like, oh, oh, no, it's like, like, this woman really just checked Twitch's gangster, and they're, they fold it hard, so, I mean, how are you going to... That makes you look bad as a company. Yeah, well, a lot of stuff <laughs> made them look bad. Yeah. But, and the crazy part is, too, like, Twitch is damn near ne as close to goddamn OnlyFans. Actually, it's just about OnlyFans. And Pretty much. Close to there, yes. Mm -hmm. Hot tub streams, the, uh, the women I wear, small shirts on there, show off their cleavage to give views. And don't trust me, I'm not knocking to hustle. If I had it, I would do it myself. I would probably show pussy on stream. Say, no, let me stop. <laughs> but nah, like... It, I'm sorry. He said was you heard me. Streaming. He opened up that pussy on live. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Wasn't oh. it open? Still <laughs> the podcast. Still the podcast. Still the podcast. <laughs> are, is, that against, saying, is that against guidelines? Oh, we edit that out. And when I say Who? we, I mean... I mean, uh, I mean, say... Who edited it? What up? <laughs> <laughs> I ain't editing shit. This is an unedited podcast. Purr. <laughs> purr. purr. Never. It, can y'all stop? Big purr. Mm. Say not anyway. But now, what, 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 how you feel about the this whole Twitch thing? I haven't heard from you much. Twitch debacle. It's a little alarming, considering that's the only platform I really do use now. Mm-hmm. Cause you'll definitely find a bunch of weirdos, especially on like the small, like the smaller streams that actually just do strict content and everything. Mm -hmm. So it's not unbelievable that that would happen to people at the cons and everything, especially if they're more well known and everything. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. just those no, weird so fans we're, and everything. So, so were these like big name streamers or were these like hot tub streamers? Some were hot tub. Okay, it could be a mix of both and everything. Like, even still, though, like, there, there, I've talked about this to y'all before. Like, there is no more public privacy anymore. Like, there is none. Because, well, like, the industry they sign even if a famous, different. that's true. Yeah. That is true. But, I mean, like, still, like, if you see a famous person out to eat with their family or whatever, you know the paparazzi going to be waiting outside taking pictures of them. Yeah, well, I'm you know outside I mean? waiting for him. I'm already inside. Can I get a picture? Can, can I get a picture? Yeah. <laughs> Give me a picture. Fuck <laughs> your kids. Let me stop me. S O D. But yeah, they. It's sad. That's what they signed up for, but I couldn't feel too too bad about it because they got more money than me. And when so you I say that's what mean... they signed up for, what are you saying? No, like, the, like if okay, a Twitch streamer, they're out here to be known. They want people to watch their shit, right? Mm -hmm. In order for people mm -hmm. to watch them, they got to know who they is. And now if you get a mass following, which you're, that's, I'm pretty sure that's what you're aiming for, the fuck, you're not expecting a million, out of a million people not to run into not, not one of them outside of this? Outside of your uh, yeah. place? It's just not plausible. Now, here's my thing, right? I would gladly... Gladly, gladly, a hundred thousand times sacrifice my public appearance if it means I get to have all the money I need to survive in life. Yep. Listen, I'm with if that. Maybe I gotta have my decent house and my nice cars. <laughs> Sign me up all day, every day. Now I understand Listen. it gets gonna get boring at one point, but I mean it's gonna you're gonna, it's gonna get overwhelming at one point. But damn, that's that's something you have to like. You feel me? Can't have it both ways. But go oh ahead, no. Boss. Let me let me find out I can sell feet pics online. Find out. I already started. Let me find. Let me like huh? started. Huh? I bet. How much you making a you month? Find me under. It's like no, nah, I ain't gonna get some. Fuck around. I probably give him somebody wow. else's account. I'm, Say it's I'm yours. selling them my my callous bunion ass feet. Oh my god. I bet some people are into that. Yeah, I don't I can want to see somewhere somebody's into it, bro. There is there mm -hmm. was on the top one percent uh, OnlyFans woman, somebody paid her four thousand dollars to pour milk on herself. Huh? Hey, yo, actually, you know what's funny about that? So I heard apparently that the uh, the number one OnlyFans person who does that she doesn't even get naked. 
Oh yeah, they don't even have to. Like like oh. like Karina Kniff, she don't even have to get naked. I think she does show her, her show her uh her breasts. You know that, huh? Why do you know that? Oh, her name. <coughs> what the hell is that? Because she was a she was an influencer. We're getting into the name. deep. We're getting into the catacombs of Sable's personal life. Honestly, nah, bro. I just know. I know. I know some influencers. I just don't know a lot of Twitch streamers or OnlyFans models. That's that's really it. I know, you know some influencers. influencers. Yeah. Bro, Listen, I'm not gonna lie yeah. to you. Bro, get them on the podcast, bro. Get them oh, on the podcast. Yeah, literally. Oh my let god. Let me find out. No, let me, let me see. <laughs> see, that better be a day that I'm out of time. Uh, uh, I'm out of town. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to be. <laughs> Hitting game. <laughs> like, yo, I'm, I'm like, let's wait. What you talking about? If I was to get Karina Kniff on here, <laughs> yeah, I'd be like, so uh, <laughs> he's stupid as you shit. need any stand ins? <laughs> oh my god, Moss gonna be standing in with a horror. It ain't long, it's kind of yeah. small, but I mean, I know these chicks they love endless shrimp because I can go around. Um, he's stupid. <laughs> he said they love endless shrimp. Yo. <laughs> yo, he's goofy. But nah, bro. Be like, let's bring up their craziest controversies. Go. <laughs> I heard you drunk, sir. What you? How did that go down? But nah, I wouldn't do that. I don't. I don't have to talk that. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not for the drama. Drama brings views, but I just, I'm just not for it. Bro, the more that I get, like the older I get, like the older I get, the more gray hair I have, the fatter and out of shape I get. God. The more like, the more I just don't deal with the drama no more. Like literally, I've cut off people I've known for years just because they want to start stuff all the time, and I'm just like, listen, mm -hmm. that's not worth it. You are not worth it. Remember that guy Savon? Yeah, he got cut off, bro. D yeah, we was all we <laughs> all started that we all started smoking that Savon pack, not that Vaughn pack. That's different. <laughs> R.I.P. You know what I'm saying? All respect. He yeah, uh, he he did. Yeah, hold on now. I ain't say all that. He, <laughs> he is he he was one of the best modern day storytellers. That's all I'm saying. Put some, res oh, no, put I'm some respect on that on the name. The fuck? The, oh, I was talking about King Vaughn. I ain't trying I was to not talking about King Vaughn. The they don't play down there. That's oh. all I'm saying. <laughs> I was talking about. Well, we all knew I was talking about the Vaughn, right? I did. See, I didn't want to just say Vaughn because I could take that could be a well, you might get you might have people show up in the door. That's all I'm saying. Niggas, you crazy. <laughs> yeah. you See, they are actual shooters. They are actual killers. shooters. Good. And they got money to get to where I'm at. You good. But hold on. Let me save up a few checks to meet them down there. Hold on. They can come same day shipping. I'm good. But yeah, man, it's uh. But yeah, that'd be pretty cool. I would like to be in that that light one day. <clears throat> what? One day. Having the what? Like King Vaughn having no, to hide everywhere. God damn it, influencer! God damn it. <laughs> oh, you want to be an influencer? No, I started this podcast for my own fun. Oh. Honestly. I mean that makes sense. It's gonna sound Whatever weird, but I happy. hate that. I hate that term, influencer. Influencer. What do you like to call it? Yeah. Oh, YouTuber. Call it how it is. Don't say influencer. Well, who are they really influencing? The you, you will be surprised. Who are they really influencing? Because yeah. I know, I know they ain't. I know they're not influencing these teenagers. Because I don't know about y'all, but me as a teenager, I was broke. Children and I couldn't do all this. Me. I couldn't. They, I couldn't go get can. a Lamborghini like them. You might not be able to. They can influence you to do some other, like buy their tickets to to, to their show. Uh, you ever seen them ads and stuff, bro? They get paid like forty thousand for like a thirty second ad, bro. Because they know people are going to click that ad, yeah. <laughs> and today's sponsor of the video, Raid Shadow Legend. Come on, Raid. Stop playing with me, bro. <laughs> For the lulls. <laughs> For the lulls, bro. I even take a 10 <laughs> down. Yo, yo Jamir, what are you telling me about how Raid Shadow Legend pays people tons yes. of money? Fuck tons. That's okay. why you've seen it so much. Bro, I don't know one person that actually played that game, though. Bro, you'll be surprised. You, you Do you know, know anybody that actually play that game? Y'all might not know nobody, but it's, it's somebody. It's somebody. Somebody's got them little kids playing that game. The game literally plays since, for you. I yeah. bet since you play that game. Why? Why? Why are you like this? I don't know. I don't even know that. Didn't you have beef? <laughs> didn't, didn't you have beef with him in middle school? I never had beef with anybody. 
You got beef with JC. You told him no, to I'm shit. To <laughs> what about that? What about that dude that, that you told him to <laughs> shut up and he was just sitting there? Who was that? All right, so yeah, we're gonna end it right there. Thanks for coming. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure y'all drop a like, leave a comment, <laughs> and we'll see you on the next ep the next episode. Peace.